Hello, Chair, um, Council Members. Thank you for letting me speak. Okay, I'm just going to be straight up. Has any of you ever experienced coming close to being homeless? Or even thought or put yourselves in that predicament? In your mind? Have you taken your minds to where the homeless people are, the homeless children are? If not, then honestly, you wouldn't have any idea what it would be like if all these children would be considered criminals because they sleep on sidewalks. My daughter, my daughter is a big, big, big inspiration to my husband and I, and she's the, she's the glue that keeps us together. I mean, these sweeps, confiscating our stuff, are the only things we have is not helping at all, straight up. We understand why there's sweeps. It's to beautify the community. Garbage control, we understand that. But to confiscate our items, which Ross Sasamora, um, the director, had mentioned that there's no fee, they waive the fees or whatever for uh, necessities, you know? that's. Yes, <laughs> I'm sorry. That's not true. Because before this year happened, they used to just throw everyone's stuff into that dump truck, into the rubbish truck, and it, you couldn't get it back because it's rubbish now. I have video of them destroying my items before placing them in the bins to take it to the storage. I'm not paying $200 for destroyed items that I bought So I'm just asking you guys to reconsider passing this bill because it's not going to happen. Nothing is going to change this way. Thank you. Thank you for your testimony. Members, any questions?